Hi, welcome. Simon here. Hope you guys are doing well. In this video, we'll be replacing the battery on an HP laptop. So this is the replacement battery. As you can see, that the battery should be all flat. There's no lump or swollen on the battery. And if you take a look at the laptop here, it is not even, especially right here at the bottom left corner. You can see that the, the laptop is bulging. It's kind of swollen on the battery pushing the trackpad is not clickable as well as some of the keys are hard to press so let's jump right into it we're going to replace the battery and let's identify the model here so this is HP Pavilion X360 model is 14-BA253CI all right there are hidden screw right underneath the rubber stopper so you need to peel that rubber stopper out by using a prying tool to get underneath that there's none on the bottom part of it there's only two top left and top right corner so remove that two and get a Phillips screwdriver And there are three more screws here at the very bottom. I'll be using the 1.5 Phillips. That is the size of the screwdriver. The screw is a lot smaller, so you need a smaller screwdriver for that. Okay, once you have removed the three screws, I'm going to jump right into removing the palm rest, the back cover, I'll be using the this metal prying tool to go in between the corner. We need to remove the back cover. And there's a hidden screw right here in the middle. I missed that part. So you do definitely need to pry open that little plastic and get into that hidden screw. Okay, at this point here you can't just pull it right out because the keyboard is still attached to the cable and to take a look at the cable you need to kind of flip it forward and you can see that the cable is still attached to the uh, motherboard you need to flip open that little clipper once the clipper is open you can slide the cable down uh, same thing for the keyboard backlighting and do that and this is the trackpad Okay, once you have opened up three of the cables, then the entire palm rest will just come right off. And at this point here, you can see that the battery is swollen. Uh, slightly, there's a lump onto the battery. You can see that the battery is not flat. So to remove it, you need to 
I need to disconnect this cable here. Kind of put it to the side. Okay, and the battery replacement model is BK03XL. It is not the same as the one that I thought it is. Yep, so this is the uh, HT03XL. It's different, it's slightly much longer. Um, it's bigger, so I do need to buy a replacement battery for this BK03XL. I don't have it with me, so I need to special order for that. Um, I do need to jump right into the hard drive and change this to a solid state drive. So it won't be in this video. I'll make a separate video for that. But however, uh, check the link down description below. I'll link it to either Amazon or eBay where you can find the replacement battery. And if you do find this video is helpful, please give it a, a thumbs up. And thanks for subscribing. Until next time, bye now.